Hi guys, my name is Ozzy, and today I'm going to be doing a review on the Supreme Cash Cannon. They did a collaboration with Cash Cannon, which is a company that makes guns that shoots money. And um, a lot of you are probably wondering, why would I even need something like this? Really, this is literally just a flex piece. There's, there's no way to sugarcoat this. People, it comes with play money, but let's be real. If you if you buy a Supreme gun, you're using it to flex your money. And yes, yeah, shooting money in the air is fun. But don't get it twisted. I would never go to a strip club because why would I throw my money on people that don't deserve it? I should be throwing the money at myself because I deserve the money. Not strippers, but that's a story for another day. So uh, basically, I didn't buy the uh, uh, quote-unquote official, official version because it came out on the Supreme website. But the retail for that was like ninety eight to a hundred dollars. So I was just like, mm, it all is. It only really matters about what's going on the inside, which is the money. So, as you can see, this is the box. It says Supreme, the cash cannon with the dollar sign right here. And then on this side is plain, plain, plain. Then on the bottom, there's nothing there. So, then on the top, it's the picture of the money gun. This is actually my second one that I'm buying. Which is very funny because I, I bought a one the first one I bought I didn't even do a review on it I just bought it so it came in this uh, little padded bubble wrap you know bubble wrap is fun to pop you know what I'm saying it's lit and then it comes with uh, the Supreme money right, let me go ahead and get that focused yeah there you go get that focused a little bit more you guys can get a clear picture there you go yeah. Let me go ahead and take out the off the rubber band. We're gonna go ahead and put that in the box for now. So basically, the actual version, the one that they sold on the Supreme website, it uses uh, D batteries, which are those rectangular batteries. They're like blocks. But this one, the unofficial version, it uses double A batteries. So I have two double A Duracell batteries right here. And once the batteries are in, let me make sure I put this in properly. Once the batteries are in, it's going to make a, a wing sound. So this is what it looks like on the inside. This is the little motor that pushes the money in and out. And yeah. And then like right here, you look at the front. It's like, you see that little metal thing? And you go ahead and focus it one more time. See that metal thing right there? And when you push it down, it lets the money out. So, yeah. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and put the I'm gonna go ahead and put the money outside. Mm, sorry, I'm messing up my words here. I'm gonna go ahead and put the money inside the gun. Let's go ahead and take this box, close it up. Just try to wrap in there. I'll save the box for later. This is gonna be like decoration and for storage too. So this is the gun right here. Let me make sure I'm focused out. Okay, so as you can see, oh man, I'm, all right, now time for the test run. All right, now time for the test run. Well, you know when I when you put too much money in there, it, it gets jammed. So I think that's probably one of the weaknesses of the gun. So let me try to put a little bit more money in here. Hopefully, it doesn't jam this time. But uh, we shall see. In theory, you should be able to fill it up all the way. So, look at that. When you put too much money in it, it, it jams. See that? It, it, it jams. It just gets stuck. So, you can't put too much money in there. So, that kind of sucks. It's supposed to be a flex piece. How is it going to be a flex piece if you can't even... If you can't even shoot more money out? So, yeah. So, basically, if you put, like, maybe 20 bills in... It should shoot it out, but if you put too much money in there, it's gonna jam. I don't, I don't know why. So I guess you got, you gotta put twenty or less bills in. Yeah, so that's all of it. It's not, it's not as fun if you can't shoot more bills, but I guess it kind of gets the job done. So basically, when you don't have any money in, it's gonna go all the way in. The little, the little cap. See, this is what happens. Like, the more money is in here, the higher the cover goes. So when there's nothing in there, it just goes all the way down like that. So yeah, and oh yeah, I forgot to mention this, but the Supreme, it's like, it's not printed on, it's like, it's 3D printed on, so, it has like this touch to it, which is pretty cool, 
So it's not cheap quality. It's really nice. And uh yeah. Look at the Supreme money. Now let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and do it with like some real money and see how the difference is. Guys, I gotta apologize in advance. I don't usually flex so but this is actually kinda of fun. I'm not even gonna hold you. Did all of them come out? Okay, yeah. Oh wait, there's still some in here. There you go. Alright. So like I said earlier, I have two of them. So you know what I'm saying? I'm out here just running up the battery. That's funny. And I'm gonna be like <laughs> Oh yeah, I guess I didn't really do like a a better way of showing you guys the money inside. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. This is basically the process. You gotta make sure the money is as straight as possible so that way it jams less. So put the money inside. You guys can see that. You know what I'm saying? But don't worry guys, all my money is fake, so this is great. Yeah, so that's fun. Alright. Now let's go ahead and try it with some real money. You know what I'm saying? Put a couple fives in here. Got fives. Slide them in there. Make sure it's as straight as possible. Oh, I already messed up. I'm gonna have to do that again, y'all. Because if the money's not straight, it's gonna it's gonna jam inside the machine. You wanna make sure it's as straight as possible. You see that? That's as straight as I can make it. And then Bam. Just shoot out quickly. Let's go ahead, let's go ahead and do that a little bit more. A little bit faster this time. Put some more bills in here. Make sure it's as straight. Look at that. I don't know why I keep messing up on camera. It's like when you're on camera, you make more mistakes. But let me go ahead and make it as straight as possible. Put it in there. That way it doesn't jam. And are we good? We good, uh, video editing team? All right, cool. Got the Supreme Gun. Now let's go ahead and aim it straight, because I don't think I'll show you guys what it looks like if I shoot it straight up. So, that's how it looks. Probably. I'll probably do like some slow motion cuts in here. You know, the reason why I even know about these guns, I forgot who's you know, it was because of, uh, I saw it on Ugly God's Instagram page, and I also saw it on this other YouTuber. I can't remember his name, but I just saw it on YouTube, and also in the Draw music video, he was he was using cash cannons too. It wasn't the Supreme. This was before the Supreme one came out, but the actual brand, the cash cannon, they had like uh, they have money guns. So that's just the original brand. Supreme just did a collaboration with them. Because Supreme doesn't make their own that they sell on a regular basis. But Cash Cannon does. That's where the collaboration comes from. So that's pretty cool in itself. Um, I guess. Let's just go ahead. Okay, okay. I know I know what I can do. Check this out. I'm going to put I'm gonna put money in both of the guns. And then we're going to shoot them both at the same time. And then see how that goes. Because we got, we got two Supreme guns. So I think that'll, that'll be pretty lit. You know what I'm saying? So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's see how much money we can stuff inside these guns. All right, be patient with me, y'all. Y'all gonna see it. This is gonna be raw, unedited part right here. I can see the struggle. Having a money gun isn't as fun as you think. Cleaning up is pretty annoying. I'm not even gonna hold you. Put a couple fives in this one. Then put some more fives in this one. All right, slide it in. All right. Go ahead and take these out because these are too small. All right, now let's go ahead. Oh, look at that! I already, I already done messed up. Let me go ahead and fix my mistake. I shot it out too quickly. Now we gotta go ahead and put it in again. See that? This is why you guys gotta see the raw. Y'all be thinking that this video shooting stuff is always so smooth and flawless, but really, so much mistakes goes into this. It's ridiculous. So let's go. Let me see. Let me zoom out some. I guess. <sighs> Goodness gracious. How much can I zoom out? Mm, okay. Since we zoomed out a little bit, let's go ahead. It's like I'm like this is this is like we're playing Call of Duty, but we have money guns, cash cannons. <laughs>
Ah, now it's all out of money. So, see how fun that is? All right. See that? Two guns. You know what I'm saying? Two guns. This is the only type of guns we should have in America, by the way. Money guns. Let's flex on each other instead of killing each other, you know? But, you know, since I'm black, I probably shouldn't go outside shooting money. Cops are going to shoot at me thinking that I'm having real guns. Because apparently cops can't tell the difference between toy guns, phones, or real guns. You know, they use them all the time. Which is just great. So I'm probably just going to use this at home for parties, celebrations. Like, if I got a promotion at work, I probably invite my friends over and, you know, we eat. And then I just go ahead and share the blessings, you know? Be like, hey, we, I got a promotion, so everybody eating today. And shoot the money. Cue it in, and it's straight. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> the Supreme Cash Cannon review. And, yeah, this was actually pretty fun, you know? I didn't mean to flex on you guys like this, but don't worry. I'm a broke boy. I'm still in college. All this money is going to go straight back into books and tuition. So, yeah, and uh, that's all for now. So, uh... Peace. I ain't really wanna do it. I pulled up, drop top, you know I dropped the 